Hello everyone, and welcome to my Vanderpump official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Lala Kent, star of Bravo's Vanderpump Rules, recently said something that many took to be a derogatory remark about her co-star Ariana Maddox. Most Bravo viewers agreed that jealousy was the root of this deceptive comment. Was Lala fuming with resentment when she observed her co-star's meteoric rise from the sidelines? Fans thought that was what was going on. Page Six claims that there is a rumor that Lala Kent, star of Bravo's Vanderpump Rules, made her shady comment out of envy. Lala made the decision to address the rumors and provide an open explanation for her remarks. Exactly what was said by Lala Kent. Could she be envious of Ariana? For more information, continue reading. Shady comment explained by Lala Kent. Are you envious of Ariana Maddox? Vanderpump Rules 11th season trailer was just released. The next season, as fans are aware, debuts the following month. Lala Kent remarks in the teaser how wild it has been for Ariana to take advantage of her sadness. I have never seen anybody to be betrayed and then miraculously turn into God. It seems that many Vanderpump Rules viewers felt Lala Kent's statement that Ariana turned her heartache into gold by becoming God was sneaky and offensive. More than that, fans thought she was just jealous when she stated it. But Lala is adamant that fans are misinformed. Was the comment misinterpreted? Lala Kent addressed the matter on social media. I've always thought highly of her. That, in my opinion, has been evident throughout time. Have we experienced highs and lows? Indeed. But to witness my friend recover so well from such heartache, I'm overjoyed for her and incredibly proud of her. Ariana is a fantastic performer and dancer, Lala continued. She also deserves all of the current success that has been bestowing upon her. She disregarded the trailer. Lala Kent went on to say that the fact that the teaser is creating so much controversy is a positive sign for the program. She went on to say that was the trailer's whole point. According to Lala, the program would be destined for failure if the public hadn't gone crazy over the season 11 teaser. She thus welcomes all of the conversation. Moreover, she is not at all bothered by what people are saying. It makes no difference to me if you adore me, detest me, think I'm amazing, or believe I'm jealous. You never stop saying my name. I want you to remember Ariana's name. You should live and breathe Vanderpump rules, in my opinion. Lala says that any press is good press. Do you believe that Lala Kent is merely defending herself in an effort to appease Bravo fans? Or do you believe that, as she says, people simply misinterpreted her comment? Let us know what you think by leaving a comment. For all of your TV news and updates on the newest drama, be sure to check back frequently at TV Shows Ace. Contrary to what us believed from the Vanderpump Rules Season 11 trailer, Ariana Maddox, and Lala Kent get along well. On Monday, December 11, Bravo unveiled a teaser for the forthcoming season, showcasing the entire ensemble coping with the fallout from Tom Sandoval and Reckle Levis romance. Lala, 33, seemed to disparage her coster's accomplishments, while Ariana, 38, flourished in both her personal and professional lives. I have never known anyone to be betrayed and then turn into God, Lala stated as the video came to a close. Following her public breakup with 41-year-old Sandoval, fans immediately questioned if Lala was envious of Ariana's achievements. But Lala dispelled rumors that she doesn't think Ariana is great. I've always thought highly of her. I believe it has been evident throughout the years, she said to the audience on Wednesday. December 13 during an Amazon Live. Had there been highs and lows for us? Indeed. But to witness my friend recover so well from such heartache? I'm overjoyed for her and incredibly proud of her. That's what the trailer is designed to achieve. The Give Them Lala podcast host stated, taking offense to her statement that she suddenly becomes God. We want people to be agitated by it, which is why we're seeing them debate in the comments section discuss the trailer, and offer input. Lala didn't care about the negative reaction to the teaser, even though people were upset. 
She said, We no longer have a show the second, no one has an opinion on the television we're making. Therefore, it doesn't matter to me if you think I'm amazing, you can't stand me, or you think I'm jealous. You never stop saying my name. I want you to remember Ariana's name. I want Vanderpump rules to become ingrained in your being. On Thursday, December 14, Ariana used social media to provide an update on her friendship with Lala. She wrote about her in comments on TikTok. But even since we stopped filming, she has been genuinely very kind and supportive, and I adore her so much. Correct? She said in response to a comment suggesting that Lala's remark might have been influenced by Ariana's choice to remain silent with Sandoval during the season 11 final. Except that a production request can be declined by anybody. Neither I nor they are God. Just one person who declined, as many other cast members have done. Fans of Bravo haven't only been interested in Ariana and Lala's current status. Tom Schwartz disclosed in another scene of the teaser that he had previously slept with Sheena Shea in Las Vegas, presumably during his marriage to Katie Maloney, who is now his ex-wife. Things that were intended to go to the grave was what Sheena, 38, wrote in an Instagram remark, pleading with followers to wait for the full story to play out on film. However, it's not quite what you think. Watch this space. Vanderpump Rules' 11th season will debut on Bravo on Tuesday, January 30 at 8 p.m. ET, and the following day, it will be accessible to stream on Peacock. The fervent anticipation of Vanderpump Rules' season 11 among fans was understandable given how firmly they held onto the trailer. Lala Kent's remark at the very end of the teaser was one trailer scene that generated a lot of conversation. Lala said, Perhaps in reference to Ariana Medics, I have never experienced someone who gets cheated on and suddenly becomes God. Viewers of the teaser saw her tone and remarks as unadulterated jealousy directed at her accomplished co-star. Lala took to Instagram in response to the conversation surrounding her purported jealousy. She wrote, Joyful of what? Alongside a statement from Sutton Strack and a nude photo. Your hideous leather pants. But even that was met with opposition. Lala made the decision to be more transparent. Lala reiterated her affection for Ariana in an Amazon Live. I've always thought highly of her. I believe that has been evident over time, she remarked. Have there been highs and lows for us? Indeed. But to witness my friend recover so well from such heartache? I'm overjoyed for her and incredibly proud of her. Lala also expressed gratitude for Ariana's performance on Dancing with the Stars and her recent casting in Chicago as Roxy Hart. Lala remarked, The girl can act, she has pipes, and she can dance. Her conviction that Ariana deserves everything that is coming her way was highlighted. Regarding her remarks in the teaser, Lala claimed they were taken out of context and hinted that viewers would be astonished by the reason. She went on to say that she didn't care for the impression the trailer gave. That is the purpose of the trailer. We encourage people to argue in the comments section since it agitated everyone and everyone is talking about it. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.